Hello Capricorn and welcome to Mystic Door Tarot. This is Barb with your weekly tarot card reading for June 24th through the 30th, 2024. Now for this week, I'll be doing a very quick reading to see what messages are coming through for the week ahead, as I will then be moving on to the July monthly readings. So as always, Capricorn, take what resonates as that is what you're meant to hear and leave the rest behind. So let's get started. Now this is the Angel Tarot card deck, but what I'm going to be looking for is the angelic messages and communication and guidance coming through. So we're going to be looking at your angel number meaning. So what's coming through for Capricorn for this current week? Messages for Capricorn. <laughs> we have the Major Arcana card, the Tower coming in. This is number 16, which reduces down to seven. So seven is your first number. Next, Queen of Swords. It's a court card, so it, it doesn't have a, a number associated with it, um, but there's a reason that came out. We have the Ace of Wands, so that is number one. So we have seven, one, one, another Ace here, okay. Right. So we're looking at the um, angel number meaning with 711. Now the number 7 energy, it brings in energies of learning, education, spiritual development, awakening. It's in regards to independence, uh, individualism. It is persistence of your purpose, your inner strength. And number one, and you have it twice here, that is the karmic master number 11 to start off with. But number one is striving forward, pursuing your goals. It's in regards to your instinct and intuition, Capricorn, your ambition. It is changes, new beginnings, and starting fresh, so to speak. So the angel number 711 is a powerful spiritual message from the angelic and spiritual realms to pay special attention to your thoughts and ideas as they are revealing the answers to your prayers and giving you intuitive guidance in regards to your next steps on your life journey, your life path. So 711 can suggest that new information or news of a positive nature is on its way to you. So listen to your intuition and really pay attention and heed its guidance. Now, there may be some new opportunities for you to put your natural psychic and spiritual abilities to good use uh, and service to those who need it. Everyone has psychic abilities. It's just some are tuned into it most are not. Now, your talents, Capricorn, are very unique to you, and it's your responsibility to use them for the highest good of all. This is believing in yourself, your um, intuitive messages, and trusting your angels to support you in your pursuit. So, 711 brings a message that you're doing a great job, you're on the right life path, and you're encouraged to continue along as you are. It's a sign that you have chosen your thoughts well and have made wise, wise choices, decisions. You're also being reminded of the emotion of gratitude. That'll speed up the process of manifestation. So remember to acknowledge and be grateful for all the blessings entering into your life. So it's encouraging you to maintain a positive attitude towards your life, uh, your events. You know, keep up with your, your positive attitude. Uh, affirmations, your prayers, and visualizations. Okay, that's your angel number meaning for your reading. Now, I feel that the Queen of Swords is seeing um, a straightforward path that you have, you know, straightforward going forward path. 
Um, you're being very Capricorn here, even though this is an air sign. Um, Capricorn, it, you know, you're very practical, logical, you know, A to B. And this is now, you know, just feeling that energy of you are certain you're on the right path. And your cards, your angel number message is telling you that. Even though you do see the Tower card here, this is enlightenment coming in. So the Tower card isn't always a bad card to get. It's um, like an awakening. It's a realization. It's listening to your inner guidance, you know, and getting rid of um, any negative uh, low vibrational thoughts or patterns. Um, that's kind of what, what you see um, it's actually individuals on the card, but that's what's going on the wayside there. So I do feel that, you know, you're definitely headed in the right direction, Capricorn. Now, you have not one but two aces. Inspiration, something's really going to be very passionate to you, inspiring you. There's some kind of opportunity that you can take advantage of. And your message, your angel number message was talking about, you know, show gratitude, be grateful for even the smallest of things that keeps that positive energy just kind of, you know, cycling back to you. So there's an opportunity here you're going to feel very passionate about. And the Ace of Swords is coming in as a victory. Um, Ace of Swords can be a, a message of you've been working towards something. It's been a long time coming. And so now there is opportunities here for success to, um, you know, you've achieved what you've been going after. So um, beautiful. Um, even though you're seeing the Tower card here, Capricorn, this is beautiful cards and energy because not only is it confirming you're on the right course, um, be on the lookout. You might always be too um, rational and practical, maybe overlooking things as a coincidence. There are signs and signals coming in Capricorn. So really um, tap into your intuition and uh, pay attention to what that little inner guiding voice is telling you, because this has been guiding you in a subconscious way probably all your life. You can use this intuition to your advantage. So let's take a look and see what messages um, from the universe. Let's see what else is coming through for you, Capricorn. And one just flipped out. Okay. All right. Your life is about to start moving quickly in some areas. Events that seem to have been on hold suddenly propel forward. Move with the flow and be mindful of what needs your attention most. There you go. Here's an opportunity coming in with the Ace of Swords. Something could be, um, you know, showing up. Pay attention as it's, it could launch you into um, what it is that you've been focused on, what it is that you've been working towards. So this could be in regards to relationships, uh, um, a home I'm picking up for some of you. Some of you want to get into a home or you want to move. Um, there's opportunities here. One very passionate feelings towards the other has been what I consider a long time coming and they can be one and the same. So your life is about to start to move quickly in some areas. The tower is bringing in change. Now Capricorn, if you do have a question, you can pause the video. Think of it now as we're going to see what the angels have to say from the angel answer deck. Um, they might answer your question or it might be additional messages that they feel you need to hear. What's coming through for Capricorn? This is a yes with an exclamation point. And look at that energy there. That is certainly success. That is, you know, the Queen of Swords energy here where you really know what direction that you're moving in. Feeling very courageous. Um, it's, it's very much um, what I'm picking up like a leadership type um, energy here. You might be leading and inspiring others as well, Capricorn. So let's get your final uh, message here. I did mention that it was a very um, quick reading this week. So let's uh, finish up with the uh, angel wishes message here for Capricorn. Your children are the greatest gift of all. They teach you more than you teach them. 
there's a hidden message in there, a little clue about um, possibly to think back to when you were a child or view things through a child's eyes that might help you instead of seeing change as a challenge, it's more of an exciting new adventure. All right, Capricorn. Well, that's the messages and energy for the week ahead. Thank you so much for joining me. Look for the July monthly readings that will be coming up shortly. For personal readings, visit my website, but love and abundance to my Capricorn family.